So here's a tip for Acrobat on how to place images inside of your PDF once you're inside of Acrobat. This is kind of cool. So if you guys, let's say you want to add a logo, somebody says, hey, we need a new picture here or something like that, you don't necessarily have to go back to the original file to do it. So I'm in Acrobat Pro, and you guys can do this in Acrobat Standard. You can do it in just about any version of Acrobat, for that matter, back to about 8, I think. So we're at 10 right now. So, All right, so if you open up a PDF, and you come up to the toolbar up here, if I right-click and go to Advanced Editing, on Mac, you guys can Control-click. Go to Advanced Editing and select the Touch Up Object tool right here. Now, if you come out to your page, any page you want, you can right click or control click on Mac and you'll see Place Image. You guys can also paste from another program, which is kind of cool. If I choose Place Image, it's going to say, all right, well, which image do you want to place? Well, I'd like to put another picture out here, so I'll go to Fountain and thank you, Adobe Updater, for coming to the rescue. I'll go to Fountain, click Open, and it'll stick it on my page. Now you guys use a bunch of different files. As a matter of fact, I forgot to show you that. Let me right click again and go to place image and I'll come right here. You guys will see the different type of file formats we can use. Bitmap, GIF, JPEG, Ping, TIFF. And I'm pretty sure this is similar between Mac and Windows if you guys try this on both platforms. But anyway, I'll click cancel. I've got my image out there. I can move it around wherever I want to. I can put it over the top of these. I can put it on the bottom. Let's suppose I want to align them up with this image. You can always resize the image, which is kind of cool. So if I click and drag, you're going to see that I can resize it a bit. Try and get it close to the other ones. I can also move it. I can right-click or control-click on the image. And you'll see that we can cut it, copy, paste it on other pages. We can do things like um, flip it horizontally, vertically, whatever we want to do. If I right-click on it again, we can also rotate it. So if you want to rotate it, like let's say about, I think it's like 90 degrees, clockwise or counterclockwise, or if you want to rotate it yourself, click Rotate Selection, come to a corner, click and drag, and you can rotate it. All right, let me undo that. So there's a lot of things we can do. Let's say you got a logo or something like that you need to put out here, which is pretty cool. So anyway, I just wanted to show you guys a quick way to be able to add images to a PDF you already have.